it's a droider with uh, part two of the Skyjib Light X4 build. Um, as you can see, it's pretty much come together the frame wise at the moment. Nothing's tightened up. I'm just um, getting used to the new way of building these. Um, I've got to say the engineering is uh, is something to be believed. It's uh, very good, very good. I can see why it's taken so long to get these machines out eventually. And knowing Linda, um, everything's got to be spot on, which it pretty much is. I really don't have any problems with it. Um, these braces are a little bit fiddly to get in. And I'm not overly sure they're going to stay because um, there's obviously quite a bit of wind catching capability there but I'll I'll, um, I'll see how it happens to fly um, the gimbal's really nice uh, to come off very easy and just a case of release the clips and it's off um, perfect I've uh, just got to work out now what I'm going to do with all the electronics or the connectors but there's plenty of room in here to make some connections up uh, for some flying leads so this can be replaced by a sampling module or another kind of infrared camera maybe or another smaller gimbal if required or even a, um, a battery, another battery mount to mount more batteries on for flight duration uh, we'll see that's all in the future um, and then the legs come off a little bit more fiddly not quite as easy but it's just these four screws here so for transporting it um, it's it is quite quick to break down and get in the van uh, because as it is now to transport in the back of the van 24 7 365 is a bit of a mare um, plenty of room for the electronics on top the um, these aren't fixed on properly yet. Uh, I'm going to use all the plates that come with it. I've got the um, electronics, uh, the power distribution board on there now for the ESCs. Um, there's plenty of room on the plate for the electronics. Uh, and I'm going to be using the, the Wukong. So it's very nice. Very nice indeed, and this will come off quite quickly as well for accessing uh, the ESCs or for repairs, I would have thought, but ooh, don't say that word repairs, because it isn't going to need repairing. Uh, so, um, just I'm probably going to get on with the motors now and get some motors on it, and then play around with the electronics, how it's all going to go on there. Maybe tomorrow. So... Um, the same impressions so far, absolutely the dog's jobber.